smoking with the Migos. It's just me and me and Migos. Uh. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today is another video for you guys, and I'm uploading this on Wednesday. It's kind of strange, I know. I'm uploading three days this week. Why? Because I noticed that my last video was off topic and you guys didn't enjoy it as much. Uh, a lot of you guys did enjoy it, but most of you guys who are BMW enthusiasts didn't even enjoy it, which I'm sorry about, and I promised two uploads, and that means good uploads, so um, this this actually happened to me yesterday when it was actually raining. When it was raining the other day on the highway, uh, my car started steaming up. I don't know why. I saw start, I started seeing smoke come from the side of my hood, and uh, you know, at first I thought it was just, you know, rain, the little, you know, just a little mist of rain just going on my hood and just coming off, but then I saw, like, my, uh, my windshield started, like, fog up just a little bit and I was like okay something's clearly going on pulled over to the side of the road opened up the hood and uh, I just saw like pretty much a little like steam pretty much come out of the hood just one little puff and that was it so there was no smoke um, which was great and I'm happy but it, it, it's pretty much stopped when I stopped the car so I came to the conclusion that um, you know like you have the little uh, the guards around your wheels let me show you guys so as you guys can see there is no weather guard right in there in Pretty much the wheel was spitting water all over. You can see the dirt all over the expansion tank. There's dirt all over my cables. Honestly, if I would have kept on driving, I could have probably ruined my headlight. That would have been a joke. There's dirt all over here. And there was water all over here when I pulled over on the engine. And I'm sure that's what started making it steam up and everything. I mean, on this side, if you guys see, it's just dust. I'm a little concerned why this is super oily. If you guys know what this is exactly, let me know. And if that should be a concern for me or if yours is really oily and that's just how it is. I don't know, but other than that, there's no water on this side, mainly because I actually have a weather guard in there. This side, as you guys can see, even on the, the support, the crash support, it's really, really, really dirty, like mud. And that's because of me not having a weather guard there, and that probably could have made a lot of damage. Like, luckily, my headlight still works fine, even though there's a lot of dirt. I started wiping it off a little bit, but you can clearly still see a lot of it. I'm just happy it was something very minor. I thought I actually, like, messed up my engine. I mean, you never know what BMW is. I mean, I, I was I was expecting something a lot bigger, but this is kind of minor, I'm hoping. Uh, I don't think I really damaged anything, thankfully. Like, to be honest with you guys, I completely forgot that the weather guards were missing. Like, I, I remember I replaced that one, but I completely forgot about that one because it was summer, and I just, not really summer, but you know, like, it, it didn't even rain. Like, it doesn't rain in California. Like, not that often, but it started raining recently, and uh, that's just really what messed up my car. Hopefully, I, I drove it today. It seems pretty good. It's still only like 10 a.m., so I mean, uh, I, I just drove it a little bit just to see how it is, and uh, everything seems to be fine. Engine runs fine. Everything's fine, thankfully. Uh, but yeah, I just wanted to keep you guys posted. Uh, you guys are going to need weather guards. You guys are going to need to make sure that uh, your engine compartment is, uh, there is no access for direct water. I mean, from the bottom of the car, I'm missing the weather guards. I don't really care about those to be off to be honest with you. Um, I don't really care if my in the bottom it gets a little swiped water, but where the wheel uh, arch is, the wheel you know the wheel guard. If you don't have it there, the wheel literally splashes water everywhere in your engine bay, and that can probably cause some harm. I'm just happy I didn't do a really stupid mistake. Uh, I'm already I'm already getting a little bit of, and uh, I'm already in a little bit of a pit hole with college right now. This would not be good. I would have to drive like another car to college and that would kill all my motivation. And I'm sure guys if you have a BMW that's like your motivation to go to work and stuff. Like I don't know for some people that's that, that's how it is. I know that's how that's how it is for my brother. That's how it is for me when I have my car and I get up in the morning and I just get to sit inside of it. That's what gets me going every single morning. Go do whatever I need to do. So look out for the upload on Friday. I'm going to actually uh, probably start working on this today on my brother's car. Um, I don't want to make these like too because this is kind of like a, a topic I wanted to address. So I'm going to make it a separate video, but look out on Friday. Uh, I'm going to be uh, make, working on my brother's quarter panel. Hopefully, I can get a lot of it done, and it's going to be sick. We're going to start wrapping. It's going to be a really, really, really cool project. My brother's going to be getting done on that. And tax return season, guys, I have something big coming up. So um, stay tuned for that. That's going to be kind of insane. Um, it might... Actually, I can't say anything. I really, I really can't say anything. Uh, but yeah, so if you guys did enjoy this video and you found it helpful and uh, you guys are missing weather guards, I really suggest that you go buy them off of Amazon or eBay. They're 20 bucks for the book, like for each wheel. Definitely worth it. Um, and yeah, it's going to save you a lot of money in the long run. All right, guys, peace out. Stay humble. And I'll see you in the next one. She got me saying, Yalla, huh, baby. I need you to see me. Put the front in and put your guard down, girl. We know you ain't easy. She got me saying, Y'all love, baby. I 
I need you to see me Quit with the front and then put your guard down Girl, we know you ain't easy, you know 